Thanks for watching the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, do be sure to like, share, and subscribe. But also, you can go and click and buy our brand new line of merch. It's very exciting. We've got loads of designs. So if you can decide, and if you want to get them just in time for Christmas, click there. Click on screen. Do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah, we're here to have our relationship ruined. I've been a ball of anxiety since Wednesday. I haven't stopped shitting. That's the man that makes all the people break up and... and I thought it was the guy who puts people in like, you know, like traps and stuff. I thought we were gonna watch a horror movie. It's broken up over 8,000 couples. And not even like couples who were just going out. Married couples. 46 divorces, I would believe. Really? He's, he's counting on his Twitter. He's Scottish. So you'll probably Ooh. sound nice while he destroys our relationship. Mm, okay, well, that'll be a comforting blow. How long have you guys been together? Well, start of the year. Start of the year. Mm -hmm. So nearly a year, I'd say. We've been together for nearly three nearly years. Nearly three years now. Yeah. Regardless of what happens, we'll stay together till New Year's. Yeah. Kiss, part ways, and then off on our merry way. Part ways. Yeah, I just don't want to be alone at midnight. Daniel Sluss, who is this man? He's very young looking to be talking about relationships. Yeah, who does he think he is breaking up all these couples? He doesn't even... Probably doesn't even have it. Girlfriend or boyfriend or whatever. I don't trust him instinctively. But sometimes when I'm alone in my head, sometimes Hitler. Oh, there you go, you've got something coming. I can relate to that. <laughs> He's quite attractive. Just the same. How attractive is he? Not as attractive as you, dear. It's better. All I have to do to cheer myself up is just to picture any child under the age of 10 with an ice cream and just imagine just fucking tripping him up. In fairness though, Anybody falling over or making an arse of themselves is hilarious. Child or no. Oh, I never do, but in your head you go, imagine you just stick it out of your butt. No, I don't. <laughs> do you not? No. You know one of those relationships where you kind of just fall out of love with the person? You don't hate them, you don't not like them, you just don't love them anymore. It's really sad. It is, isn't yeah. it? I, if that happens, I just break up with you instantly because it's not fair. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Loads of Irish lads do that. What? They wait for the girl to do something so that they can break up with them. Have you ever accidentally caught yourself thinking how much easier life would be? <laughs> if they were to just die? <laughs> Okay, just, he went straight to he the top. He went straight yeah. to yeah. Yeah. It's, a, it's a logical thought process, because then you're like, I'm not the bad guy, you are. He's insane! Does that ever happen to you? John tells me to shush all the time, because I speak too loud. It, it's not, I tell you, I don't go shh. It's just, I'd ask you something, I'd be like, how's your day? Well... <laughs> and it doesn't involve either one of you getting hurt. <laughs> Emotionally. Oh my god. I want to be friends with him. I feel like he gets me. Wait, so you felt like that? You want me to say I want you to die? No, there's a third option where I don't die. That's <laughs> Okay, let's go with that one. <laughs> no, not about you. Oh yeah, but yeah, okay. <laughs> I don't know. I've, you know I've, who you are. I've met your ex. <laughs> His facial expressions are really funny. Mm -hmm. He kind of looks like a dinosaur, but in a good way. Like a hot dinosaur. It does look like a hot dinosaur. Imagine all of our lives are like our own individual jigsaw puzzles. Why did this turn into a TED talk? <laughs> Who doesn't love a jigsaw? Jigsaw's I love like a good jigsaw. That we've learned until we get the best picture. But the thing is, everyone has also lost the box. Yeah, this <laughs> is less comedy special and more TED talk. I mean, if you do not love 100% of who I am, off you fucking fuck. <laughs> I agree, but I agree with them. Don't, okay, I completely get what he's saying in one respect. If you don't take me for who I am, we're not right together. If we're going out and you don't love the fact that once a month I shave my asshole because I find it easier to wipe than... Big mood. Big mood. Convenience. Flexible. <laughs> okay, he's lost me here a little bit. I don't... If you don't wax and shave your asshole, you're doomed. If you don't do this, you're doomed. It Look makes like... wiping easier. You don't get any dangleberries. <laughs> Takeaway message is don't break up, just shave your assholes. I want to be a husband. I want to be a dad more than anything in the world. Because I guess if you're not right, Oh Look at his little smirk, he's absolutely maniacal! Is he? he is, um, insane. Well there you go, you're gonna break up with me. We gotta talk. I wouldn't say he's a fun guy, I'd say he's <laughs> an interesting character. See, I don't find kids falling funny, I find I your reaction to kids falling funny. Because you like cry. You cry. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna break up with you. <laughs> he's just saying, to be honest with you, he's just saying, 
Just be honest with yourself. Yeah. If we don't appear together again, you'll know who <laughs> badly. Hold my hand, my darling boyfriend. Oh, I'm so in love. <laughs> Get off me, please. Jesus. Yeah. God, this is what I'm dealing with. <laughs> if you haven't broken up with your boyfriend or girlfriend at the end of this video, why don't both of you at the exact same time take your little fingers, put them beside each other, and press the notification. No, press the subscribe button. Then press the bell. Terrible. <laughs>